Hi there, this is Graphic Tools Lab. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this distorted text with CC Bender by using After Effects. Before I get started, I just want to say, if you want more of tutorials make sure to hit the thumbs up button, or comment and subscribe, that's very encouraging. Thank you. Okay then, let's get started. I made composite and in text already. I made the width 1920 and height 1920 pixels. Duration for 10 seconds. Okay let's get it on. First, I'll align text to bottom. Let's repeat text. Let's select create shapes from text by right clicking. Now the text is converted to the outlines. Open Properties, go to Add, and hit the repeater. Hit to open Transform Properties. Decrease the Y position. Increase the amount of copies. Press P to open position. Toggle the expression key. Move your keyframe bar to 10 second. Drag the Y position. OK. Select Pre-Compose by right-clicking. I'll type in text. Now, let's go to Effects and Presets. Apply CC Bender Effect to Text Layer. Change the style to Sharp. Now the amount and anchor points are up to you. Drag it on until you like it. Of course you can duplicate CC Bender effect if you want. Let me show you preview just a moment. Now you can find some area, section, part, whatever. Select pre-compose by right-clicking. Hit the second one. Press controller command K to open composition settings. Okay, now we have to change about height pixels in composition settings. Press P to set video area. Go to Layer, New, Adjustment Layer. Apply Fill Effect to Adjustment Layer. Change Color to Gray. Let's activate Pen Tool. We can apply Mask Effects to make some shadow parts. I'm sorry it takes time, but this is just simple. Okay, I think it's done. Let me show you another effect to change color easily. Go to Layer, New, Adjustment Layer. Type in Triatone. Change the highlights and midtones color. Okay, we have done. Hope you enjoyed this video. So that's all for Tool Slab. Utilize what you learn and make awesome graphics. Please keep an eye on more videos to come. Thank you so so much for watching this tutorial.